Tracking your forecast, I'm Chief Meteorologist Amber Sellins, and we've still got a chance for storms across our state. Here in the valley, a slight chance for isolated showers tomorrow, with temperatures topping out in the mid to upper 70s here across the Phoenix metro area. So temperatures right near normal, but these chances for storms continuing, mainly in the higher terrain, perhaps even a little bit of snow still along the rim, and some spotty showers that might potentially move into Phoenix late tomorrow afternoon. So again, a slight chance for us, better chances up to the north, and then this storm system will finally start to lift on out and clear out of Arizona by the middle of the week. High pressure builds in after that, so warm and dry. Mid 80s in the forecast by the end of the week and start of the weekend before this next storm comes in with more rain and snow chances by Sunday. Big increase in winds over the weekend, too, and another shot of cool air taking us back down into the 70s here in the valley by early next week. Forecast tomorrow for spring training still puts us in the 70s, and overall we're looking dry, but Watch around 3, 4, even 5 p.m. for that slight chance of an isolated shower or two. Not everyone will see it, but the chance is not zero of getting some rain out at spring training tomorrow. Here's the forecast city by city. We'll top out at 76 in Scottsdale and Mesa, 77 in Gilbert, Tempe, and in Chandler tomorrow. Overnight lows in the 40s and 50s across the East Valley tonight. West Valley 2 with Levine and Glendale both down to about 52 degrees tonight. 76 for Peoria, 75 in Surprise, and 71 out in Wickenburg to our Northwest tomorrow afternoon. Here's the forecast across the rest of the state. Freezing temperatures in the 20s and 30s along the rim tonight. Sholo, one of the coldest spots statewide, as they drop down to 29 degrees. 33 in the forecast for Prescott, 35 in Payson. Those spots looking pretty cold, but staying above the freezing mark overnight tonight. Tomorrow afternoon, 60 in Sedona, 65 in Kingman, 70s out to the northwest, and Yuma hitting 80 degrees tomorrow afternoon. Phoenix not too far behind with that high of 78, and highs in the 60s and 70s out across southeastern Arizona as well. Over the next seven days, we'll see that warm up through the end of the week with high pressure building in. And for Phoenix, that's going to take us all the way up to 86 on Friday. Flagstaff will be into the upper 50s at that point and even a slight chance of lingering showers into the Wednesday forecast before Flagstaff dries out. Then over the weekend winds pick up rain and snow chances move back into Arizona. Even a slight chance for isolated showers here in the valley Sunday into Monday and that cool air taking us down to 72 by the start of next week.